Hi and welcome. Uh, I want to share some thoughts I have about 2024. It's been a great year for Mermaid Chart and Mermaid alike. And uh, I just want to give some highlights what I think has been good during this year. And uh, we've done so much, so it's pretty hard to, to choose, honestly. But uh, one focus area that's easy to pick is that we made the diagrams look better. We added the hand-drawn look and uh, we also added more layout options. And what made that possible was a big refactoring of Mermaid in the open source library that's been overdue for a bit. And this will make it much easier to streamline the features among all the graph-based diagrams. So if you get styling in one, it's easy to implement styling for all so that they are coherent. We also add 30 new shapes for flowcharts. That's uh, thanks to this new setup that, that has made that possible, that new refactoring. Uh, we also made it easier to make diagrams in Mermaid Chart. We added the whiteboard so you can move things around. Um, that's not the first thing that comes to mind when we think about Mermaid, but it's good for these circumstances where you actually do want to move move uh, node yourself and uh, perhaps my favorite part of mermaid chart is the visual editor i think that's when you get the best of two worlds you get a ui to do some editing and you also have it connected to the to the text-based diagrams so it's connected and, and in sync and uh, for the visual editor we added the state diagram and the sequence diagrams and that's just the start we'll add more as time goes. Apart from this, we, we did a lot of work with plugins. We added Confluence plugin and we added Jira plugin, a plugin for Google Docs, and uh, not the least, the GitHub Copilot extension. And that's just a few of them. And that's really good because one of the important things is to make it easy to, to use the diagrams. It's no good to have a diagram just by itself, you want to show it for someone and put it in a document or in a presentation or whatnot. And that's one of the things we're thinking about for next year. We move on to 2025 because we're just getting started. Uh, and that is to make it easier to, to use your diagrams. Even easier. I mean, we would want to have presentations in, in memory chart step better than what it is now. And we also want to add text documentation right in Mermaid Chart. And we also add APIs to extend the integrations with more platforms. And that's just a small subset. I'm sure 2025 will be super exciting. So stay tuned and uh, have a good new year. Bye.